God, look at that cloud. That is absolutely dope. Yeah. Anyway, welcome back to the Chan Chan, guys. Today we are going to an equestrian boot fair, so we're going to load up the beast up there. No, no, there. And load up the beast just there. And then, yeah, we're going to go see if we can try and sell all of our old tat, really, that we just don't need anymore. So, yeah. But first of all, I got stables to mark out, so roll the intro and I shall see you once I've done all the stables and possibly packing the old Clunjo. Let's get cracking. the art uh, mucking out is all complete we are back in the beast yes, get out this one and it's time to wipe and load and i say wipe purely because they've been in a caravan this is the last one so we're going to give them a nice wipe over make them all look nice clean them up a little bit and yeah start loading it up in the other 200 and off we go. It is not 10 past one because otherwise that means we would be late. I haven't obviously changed the clock back in this. So yes, I've got about an hour or two I need to leave. So yeah, I suppose I best uh, get cracking. Sorry, I'm reversing this into the yard. I know I have to concentrate quite a lot apparently. So yeah, in a bit. I'm in Lexi and look at them. She's seen something. I wonder what she's seen. There they come. Well, look, guys, this seems to be quite a regular thing now, me filming in this vehicle. So, we went to the we went to the boot fair, sold quite a bit, but also ended up buying a lot for Lexi. So, yeah, so what I've done now is we've unloaded everything. I'm putting the R200 back in its house. Boom, 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 boom. Next to the trailer. Concentrating. It's my concentration place there. So yeah, so everything is now back in the room. I've now stuck the rest of it online and said first person to, you know, makes me an offer I can just take it because we need it gone really. But now we're gonna get the ponies in and yeah. It was, it was a good day all in all, to be fair. It was great fun. Met loads of different people. So, yeah, it was really, really good. So, now I've got to finish up and uh, get myself home. And then it'll be uh, rolling on to tomorrow. And uh, what I'm getting up to tomorrow. Because I've decided to, halfway through, change this in to spend the weekend with me. Considering I mucked up on Friday's vlog. So, yes. Right, let's get all the ponies in then, shall we? What up guys, just a little quick haul of what uh, some of the stuff I got Lexi. Like got us some lovely Monta joppers. They're so nice. Eight pound to pay for them. Like and then we got some lovely little show jumping joppers from Decathlon. Pay about two pounds for them. And then one of the best buys was this lovely little jacket. Also a Decathlon one. That was a fiver. My favourite buy is the Ariat coat for her, a fiver. And then the best buy is a beautiful little show jumping jacket. The make is Belle uh, Quai or something. I don't know, there's the logo. But it is absolutely stunning and I love it. But she's got more, let's show ya. So what did you get? I got a pony stable stable. I didn't even know you got the picture frame. 
came with that. And then she's got a little crafty pony there with a rug. Okay. So yeah, someone got treated today at the boot fair. They've got a lot and a lot. What up guys? Happy Sunday everyone in this video's case. So yesterday we done the boot fair and I thought, you know what? I didn't actually feel much because we were so busy. So I thought I'll do this a whole weekend thing, get it out nice and early because obviously uh, I'm mucked up Friday's vlog due to my GoPro. But today it's just like going to be the biggest clickbait of all. Good morning, everyone. Oh, they will need at me. I like it when they do that. So his lordship, Finnegan, as it says in the title and the clickbait, Finnegan is moving to a new house. Aren't you? Moving to a new house. <laughs> but don't worry. He's not going far. He's literally going from there all the way over to there. And then he is going to go there. And then he is going in Finnegan Stable. Now, the reason why we are doing this is because one, Dodger weaves. So he needs that stable for the bar. And then he can be next to his girlfriend, Star. As we all seen in a previous video, that is his girlfriend. I'm going to stand out the rain because why will I do that? So yeah, we're gonna do that. Biggest clickbait of all time. Everyone's now gonna turn off the video and be like, well, that was naff. But no, I say he's moving house because we've, uh, Dodgers, oh look, he's weaving now, look. Oh, he stopped. He would stop, wouldn't they? Right, we're gonna keep it there in case he weaves. But anyway, um, the reason why Finnegan is moving house is like I say, it's because Dodger weaves, as he is doing now. But of course, he is opposite Finnegan and Maya and we have noticed that they have also tried to start weaving so we're going to put a stop to that. We don't know why Dodger weaves, we've done so much like research, asked this person, got this person, la di da di da, he just does it. So yeah, they're all going to be moving house but we will, the reason why it's going to be like a long old day of moving house is because Dodger's on straw, Puzzle's on straw. Finnegan's on shavings. So we've got to empty out Dodger stable, move all of Finnegan's shavings in Dodger stable, and then put straw in this stable. Haven't we, boy boy? Because Finnegan don't like straw, and Puzzle can't stay on shavings because he is the dirtiest thing in the world when it comes to bedding. Honestly, we've tried straw, shavings, wood pellets, deep littering wood pellets, deep littering shave. Honestly, I can't find something where that horse is not an absolute skank on. So yeah, first things first. Sorry guys, but you've all got to go out in this rain. Apart from you, because he is a diva and he will not cope in this weather. Will you, mate? No. I suppose that's what the life is for being a little ex racehorse is all about. You need a clip soon. Your coat's going all funky. So yeah, unfortunately, the rest of the guys, I've all got to go out. Oh, hello. We haven't said hello to you. You haven't really said hello. Hello. Oh, you got some eye buggies. Let's get them clean. So, yeah, let's get these ponies out. And I suppose I'd better start moving all of the furniture. Oh, look, there's Toby down there. And, uh, yeah, I suppose let's start moving all your furniture. So, let's go. So, the ponies are out. And we are in a Dodger stable. And we are on phase one of Empty Out Dodger stable. So, yeah. God, this is going to be a long old day in the rain as well. Why can't they all just be on the same bedding, honestly? If there's any bedding company out there or anyone that's trying to produce a bedding to make really dirty horses less dirty, I'm happily be a big guinea pig. Hit me up. Email me. Seriously. I happily try any bedding for puzzle. Just, just, you'll see later. Like, I will be brave enough to show you that before he went in that stable, it was a lush bed of straw. And then you will see what it looks like now. But I really got to pull my finger out because time's getting on and the rain is literally like holding up. So I want to try and get in and out nice and quick. And as you can see, I'm already wet. Here we go. We have one empty sable all mucked out. Now it's time. Did I count phase one as putting the ponies out or starting? Whatever. Next phase, <laughs> getting all the shavings from Finnegan's stable back over to here in this stable. And then it'll be moving the rugs. Yeah, move the rugs. Move Dodger's rugs next door into puzzles. But I got my puzzles out. Then move. There's just so much to do. God. It's fine. 
Mum's just bought me out a hot chocolate, so I'm like all recharged and ready to go. So next phase, stage, whatever I said, can't remember. Move fit again, get all these shavings out and make a lovely new bed. And because it's a new house, I might put another bag of shavings on, you know, new house feels and all that. <laughs> right, let's get it moved and let's get cracking. <laughs> still gonna see if my sister has ever watched any of my vlogs or if she does watch them because Finnegan's actually in Maya Stable but look at him he's like a little hermit crab he's like probably having a sulk because um I've emptied out his stable and he's like what's going on if I had to describe my horse as another animal it'd definitely be a hermit crab what would you describe your one as because mine's definitely look at him I swore <laughs> look at him he's a bloody hermit crab over there and he's sulking because I've done this but anyway Last wheelbarrow, that's mug. So yeah, last wheelbarrow, let's go uh, make his bed. And then let's take hay nets, water and rugs out and set up his new house. And then I've got to muck everybody else out. Mum, bless her up. She's, uh, she's done puzzle. Well, the now Dodger stable. So yeah, she's going along. <sighs> I'm really, really warm. I was really cold this morning, but now I'm really warm. But yeah, bit again. Grumps. Yeah, he's angry at me. But he's going to be happy. So let's go and uh, put his new bed down. Here it is. All his shavings moved over. Not going to... I can't even remember how many wheelbarrows that I've done. But yeah, still going to put a fresh bag of shavings on it. Take that down. And yeah, still loads to do. <laughs> It looks very messy because I haven't swept, but yeah. <sighs> Let's get moved in, shall we? Sorry guys, look at this quality. Oh, it's terrible quality. So, turn that down. Um, Finnegan is in his stable, he's all happy. Sorry I didn't show you his reaction, to be fair. There was nothing really to react. I didn't take the feed down, like the feed bucket holder down when I first put him in and the do donut eat his head so that is now off because he can't be trusted with it apparently so yeah uh currently sat in the car everyone's in happy mum will go out and do their night hay later but yeah currently sat here waiting because i got someone on their way to buy the rest of my boot fair stuff that i took yesterday that didn't sell so yeah i've sold that just waiting for him to come pick it up now and then i'm going to be off home so yeah, this is me signing out the end of the vlog. So I am wearing my Vibe Snud, which you can get discount off at the end of your purchase. Uh, if you type in at Kind Jody C, you get a nice bit of uh, discount at the end. So yeah, it's kept me warm. I'm not gonna lie. It is like one of my favorite color as well. So yeah, as always guys, uh, thanks for watching. A like, comment and subscribe would be fantastic because it actually helps a lot and to be fair it's really nice knowing that people actually watch this. Yeah, it is really nice to know that. But yeah, I'm going to get this one out. It won't be a Friday I come out because obviously, unfortunately, the GoPro footage for last Friday's was terrible so I'm going to get this one out as soon as possible before Friday and then hopefully the Friday with this one should have been out on will be my ride with Finn because I would have sorted out my GoPro footage. Damn, that was a lot. <sighs> and breathe. So yeah, as always guys, thanks for watching. You can follow my Instagram account for daily updates. I shall put, yeah, I will put a reminder of um, my discount code for the Vibe Equine brand. So yeah, um, have a nice evening guys. Uh, stay happy and stay positive. See you in the next one. Bye.